Morning Joe has always been a, a show that's full of people living up the ass of the establishment. They're what passes for a uh, moderate conservative uh, in 2013 America. In reality, of course, they're helplessly right-wing and helplessly stupid also. The thing is, they say about one thing per month that uh, makes sense, so they have much more credibility than a lot of other people on TV. Uh, and bottom line is, they don't give a rat's ass about the American people or the actual issues that matter. They are the epitome of partisan hacks, and they just talk about the horse race aspect of politics. So, ooh, what did the Democrats say about this? Ooh, what did the Republicans say? Uh, so listen to the comparison that these guys make about the Obamacare website rollout. Obama to continue to speak about the actions of his administration as a guy with a great seat but no responsibility is totally off-putting, and it does not have a whiff of leadership in it. And if I, if I could, on, on credibility, just like on Katrina, when the big problem the President Bush had was diminishing the significance of what was happening, saying, hey, way to go, Brownie. You had the president yesterday talking about glitches and kinks. This is bigger than yeah, glitches I mean, Ron, and the kinks. The one difference is Katrina was a He's storm. The health care law was of Obama's creation. So true, I'm, not, I'm not defending uh, uh, my White House's handling of Katrina, but it was a natural disaster. This was a disaster maybe, maybe Iraq of is Obama's a creation and imagination. Maybe the, Iraq, maybe the Iraq war is a better analogy. Oh. No! No, the Iraq war is not a better analogy, you fool! Are you, but are you serious? And I love how everybody else sits around the table and they're just like listening like somebody's making a good point. And they're like, mm, yes, very, very good point, yes. Uh, the uh, Obamacare website glitches are very similar to Hurricane Katrina and the Iraq War. The Iraq War, of, co uh, of course, where you had almost a million people die in total when you add up the civilians uh, on the Iraqi side, when you add up the American soldiers, uh, and then for, never mind the number of people that have PTSD or the people that were injured or the people that had to flee Iraq and were refugees. Yeah, that is a lot like somebody not being able to get health care within seven seconds and needing to try three or four times in order to get it done. Please, do you hear yourself? Yeah, it's a lot similar to having your house destroyed and swiped, uh, you know, swept away in a hurricane uh, to, you know, have a website that's not functioning fully uh, properly. I mean, it's, it's so stupid it hurts to hear it.